Whoa. Hold it. Yeah. Whoa. So, also, like I said, I'm on the radio a lot. I'm one of those guys that says, hey, we're on the seventh floor now. Come on at ya. We got your winger tickets. Come on at ya. Right after that, we got your fucking David Bowie tickets. I can say fucking because I'm all serious now, everybody. I always wanted to know why those guys on radio talk like that. They'd be like, 7.30 coming at ya! Why is 7.30 coming at me? It should've got out of the way before it hits. <laughs> right? I mean, the guys advertise like it's a goddamn tsunami heading my way. 7.30, everyone, I wake up with wham! Wake me up before you go, go! I sing like that fucking Indian guy in American Idol. <laughs> I love you, Sanjay, and I wanna blow you away. Fucking guy. I mean, really. Sanjaya. Fucking guy's wearing fucking leg warmers on his fucking hands. What's wrong with that guy? And what is American about him? There's not a goddamn thing American about you. You're the East Indian version of America. Go on East Indian fucking American Idol. Eat a fucking cow and serve a fucking Slurpee. And now I'm of a bitch. I mean, really, it's Christ, Sanjaya. Who the fuck? That's like naming a president Barack. <laughs> that's a JLH original mother ever. Even that. That's a, sto that's, that's a stoner saying that. Write that down. So I'll get to the beat. I'll get to the beat, get to the beat. Because I'm rocking and rolling and I'm strutting and strolling for me as being the boss in Austin. But here's the thing Hulk Hogan loves to have sex with his wife. <laughs> now, if you remember Hulk Hogan back in the 80s, he was crazy. Right? You know, he was shooting 9 million milligrams of steroids in his ass. Hell yeah. He didn't want to fuck his daughter Brooke so much. <laughs> right? You know, and he'd say things to get you out that arena. You know, it's crazy things. Really crazy things, you know. Like, I'm gonna shove swords up your ass. <laughs> or I'm gonna get a monkey and I'm gonna blow him. <laughs> Just come out to the San Diego Sports Arena and we'll do it upright, you know? They're like, I don't know what he's talking about, but I gotta get, I gotta get out there and see what the fuck's going on, okay? And you're gonna blow a monkey and shove a sword up his ass, I'm there! Hey, PETA be damned! <laughs> so, I always assumed because I was a pervert that, uh, you know, Hulk Hogan wanted to go home and have sex with his wife, right? And keep the Hulk Hogan character in play while he's doing it, right? And I always assume, you know, assume that it sounds something like this, right? Well, let me tell you something, luscious Linda. Before we get started, dude, I'm gonna fire up the wide glide, and I'm gonna take it down the left side, brother. And I'm gonna take my pirate to Penzance, dude, and I'm gonna shove it in your pirate ship, luscious Linda. Cause I'm six foot seven, two inches from heaven, and I weigh 305, and I can whip any man alive. Hey, let me tell you something, dude. I'm gonna take your vagina. I'm gonna slam it, just like I slammed that giant 20 years ago, brother. 1987, dude. And when you're rocking and rolling, even though I already said it, strutting and strolling from Maine to Spain and Boston to Austin, brother. I just got one question for your box. <laughs> What's your box gonna do with the largest steroid-induced cock? The 8-inch Hulk Hogan action figure. <laughs> and 15 million shooting Hulkamaniacs of goo runs wild all over you. <laughs> John Law Hastings,